There is something new in the Electro Online Shop. It's the Dremel Idea Builder 3D40 3D printer. And let me tell you why I love it. We can now use USB drives instead of SD cards. They have USB connection for the computer and Ethernet and they even have Wi-Fi. When you boot it up, it plays the nice sound that we know from Dremel 3D printers. First step is leveling the build platform. It has a little pin that touches the surface. It starts at the back and then it goes to the front left and checks again. Yeah, this is looking good, no problem. So now it goes to the front right side and here you can see the little pin that touches the surface. Oh, it is too high. So I have to turn the knob. The beep tells me it is OK. So I hit verify again. And this time the printer is happy. Level completed. The next step is loading the printing filament. We open the housing. And we can add the filament. First put it through the little tube. And grab it. Then insert the filament into the housing and close the housing. Now we take the filament and add it into the printing head. Cut the filament. No, I hit next. So it's heating up. Purchase the old filament, but we don't have any feed filament. So now it starts to uh, put the filament through the extruder, and there it is. It's extruding PLA. I hit done, and filament loading is completed. So now the most important step is printing. It comes with examples, so I take this chess bishop and I hit done. <coughs> There goes the platform, there goes the printing head, and now it's extruding the first layer of filament. Okay, I can really recommend this printer. It's the best one I've ever tested. You can find it in the Electro shop now. Get your own Dremel Idea Builder 3D40 3D printer and happy 3D printing. Whoa, the print just finished. There it is, my chest figure. Oh, it's hard to remove. It's very good sticky tape. Great.